Hey guys, uh, welcome to your um, love reading for Leo. This is going to be for the first half of your September from the 1st to 15th. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read with the outcome and advice. What else you guys need to know, look out for, work on. So apply this to your own unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your replacements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Leo people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and also on Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. I do also post readings on there too, you guys, okay? So tell me about Leo and love. Tell me about Leo and love and the person that they are connecting with for the first half of their September. From the 1st to 15th, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for uh, Leo, for Leo here. We have the Ace of Cups, okay. We have the Four of Cups. I mean, this could be an indication that there's an opportunity for new love that's coming in for you here, Leo. For those of you guys that are single, okay. Let's see what else we have here. We have the Moon, Cancer, Pisces here, Six of Swords, Nine of Wands, and the Six of Pentacles. You know, some of you guys could be dealing with fear or that there is someone here that has hidden emotions here for you. And because of that, the connection doesn't really quite move forward here. Whoever this is, there is someone in this situation where someone here is so guarded. Someone here is having a hard time receiving and giving love here. Now, this could be you. This could be the person that you're dealing with here. But let's just take a look. The Moon, Cancer, Pisces here. Ace of Cups. The World. Four of Cups. And the King of Wands. There you are right here, Leo. Maybe there's a situation also. Perhaps there is an opportunity for new love to come in. But for somebody, for some of you guys, some of you guys could be thinking about someone as somebody else some of, you, some of you guys could be in love with somebody else or that there's unfinished business with somebody else that you want to go back to here okay king of wands here aries leo sagittarius energy the moon nine of swords some of you guys are having nightmares yeah, okay it seems like you guys are having a hard time letting go of somebody here like i said there's an opportunity for new love but i feel like someone here is having a hard time accepting it in giving this to this new love because I feel like someone here is still thinking about someone else. Someone here hasn't moved on from someone else. Someone here is losing sleep over somebody else. Now, maybe the person that you're dealing with could be losing sleep over you because you moved on without them here, Leo. Nine of Wands and the Two of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. Someone here keeps going back and forth. It's like, Leo, if this is you, it's kind of like an energy. Okay, I should leave because this connection is just not healthy for me. It's not healthy for my mental health. But then like another part of you is like, I want to stay because I really love this person. So it's kind of like someone here has is, is in a bit of a rock and a hard place. What else do we have here for Leo? Tell me about the person that Leo is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Leo? So one of the things I'm getting here is that new love is coming to your life, but you're still holding on to this new person. Uh, no, holding on to this old person. And, you know, I always say that you can't make room for new things to come into your life you're still, if you're still holding space for old stuff, you know? And it could be anybody or anything. Uh, tell me about the person that Leo's dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Leo? Nine of Pentacles and the Four of Swords, Eight of Cups here, and the Empress. Okay. The Fool and the Ace of Swords. Why do I feel like this is your energy here, Leo? 
whoever this king is could be dealing with another Leo. Whoever this king is, this person kept a lot of secrets. Okay, this person held back. There was a lack of equal give and take here. This person got bored very easily or that this person was always unhappy or felt like they didn't deserve you. So I feel like you kind of took it as like, okay, if this person doesn't really deserve me, then I'll, I'll just walk away. You know, I'll just walk away. Because with the Nine of Pentacles and Four of Swords, I'm here completely disengaged and walked away. And you know what? I'm just, I, I'm okay without this person. And now we have someone here that's kind of losing sleep over you here. Yeah, this Empress went off to have a, nor a new beginning. Uh, Aries energy, Aquarius energy with the Fool, Empress, Libra, Taurus, Ace of Swords here. Yeah, it seems like we have an Empress here that cut this out or that couldn't deal with the back and forth anymore. Uh, tell me about the Nine of Pentacles here. We have the Chariot, Cancer Energy, the Four of Swords here, and the Three of Pentacles. A lot of you guys are focusing on your own pentacles, focusing on your own career here. Some of you guys, when it comes to your career money, it's it's kind of like on the fast track here. It's really taking off at this time. Uh, whatever you guys do, you guys are really successful and really good at what you do here. Tell me about the Eight of Cups, Five of Cups, the Empress, and the Page of Wands here. Yeah, I do feel like this masculine is coming back to apologize for what they did to you here. I do feel like this person instilled a lot of fear into you to get you to stay or to get you not to leave them or to try and test you to see, you know, how far they could push you uh, in order for you to, you know, to see if you would continue to stay with them. But I feel like you just didn't want to deal with this. Yeah, you know, the Six of Cups. In the Knight of Cups, we have someone here that's definitely looking for a reconciliation here with you, Leo. This person's definitely losing sleep over you. I mean, their karma is that you're moving on, meeting new people. You're blocking this person out, okay? Yeah, you're moving on. You're letting this person go. You're distancing yourself from this person. And I feel like that Ace of Cups is you telling this person, you know what? I'd rather move towards someone, someone new where someone here could offer me something that I'm looking for instead of this. What else do we have here? Outcome and advice. What else does Leo need to know? Look out for. Work on here for the first half of their September from the 1st to the 15th. Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Leo. The sun and the knight of wands, ten of pentacles and the two of cups. String card and the queen of cups. Lots of Leo energy here. I feel like this is you. This is you just focusing on your happiness. Yeah, focusing on your happiness. I do feel like this person will try and come back to rekindle this connection here. Yeah, you know, I just feel like, you know, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like you're not really holding your breath for this person to do better or to change because I do feel like this person is definitely in a non committal energy or definitely in player mode here. The strength card here and the queen of cups. Strength card, Leo energy, Queen of Cups. I feel like you are remaining in your power here. You're trying to remain in your power here. Uh, Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the Sun. Four of Wands, Knight of Wands here, and the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, whoever this is, I feel like this is an individual that's coming back to rekindle this connection. They don't want to, they're broken hearted for, they're broken hearted over losing you here, Leo. Yeah, they're broken hearted over losing you. The Tower, Aries, Scorpio energy, I feel like they cannot stop thinking about you. They are seeing you as their wish fulfillment, but I feel like you just don't want to play that game. Yeah, you rather move towards new love. So Leo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys, bye.